hairdressing tip day two so i'm going to show you how to do heatless curls at home with a pair of stockings or tights or even a dressing gown cord you can buy the kits also from kmart but a pair of stockings just does fine okay i can't be bothered walking into the salon so i've just put um i can't be bothered getting any hair cream so i've just put a little bit of conditioner in my ends so if you got fine hair no conditioner if you got fine hair damaged even just that enough on your hands like put just a half a pea or a quarter of a pea that's it for fine damaged hair fine hair nothing thick hair um yeah a, a pea of of hairdressing cream or i just just used conditioner right so brush it out nice and smoothly i like a middle part so get all the knots out and don't part it at the back just do a, a messy part because it's going to dry um and you don't want it to be a severe part at the back so just do a a crappy easy part okay get this it got caught up in there. No, I'm not going to rob a bank. Okay, so you don't have to put this on there, but I like that idea because it smooths this all down. You see, it's going to make that all nice and smooth. Okay, curls look better when they go back away off your face. So, this way, back away. So get all the hair don't want them too high I just want them low and so if you want a real tight curl do them up really really high up there like that but if you want a looser curl go backwards and just do a loose curl so if you can just sort of imagine that as a curl and it, the fashion at these days are straighter on top but curlier on the bottom so you don't want it curly way up on top then I've just got some little scrunchies so nothing too firm because you don't want an indentation into the hair so do that maybe flip that end around then I've seen other people, I'll just sort of put that little doggy tail around so it's got a bit of a curl. I might fix that up later so I don't have to bother years. I've seen other people um, sort of put this in, oh, footless tights would be good, but these are fine. You could go like that, you see. And put another cooler around there but I'll probably just go to sleep like that okay other side now so go backwards smooth all that hair down make sure you've got it all up oh, look there's a little bit around there make sure you get all that and then I started the curl about there so go back once again if you want a real tight one do it high but if you want a looser one do it a little bit actually that looked like it was on more of an angle so we'll try that again so back off your face so I'll sleep in this tonight and I will show you part two tomorrow when it's all dry it's best I shampooed my hair yesterday after I got it colored then it was dry but I just had a shower and just quickly duck in it underneath the tap not completely saturated just a little bit just to wet the cuticle so do that up I mean if you really love it you would want to cut that off so you don't have to have all that you know if you do this regularly you would want to cut that off and make sure you get those ends nicely so oh I think that one's sitting a bit funny since I put the um let's do this one again because I put this the end of the sock over God. okay so we'll do this one again so backwards nice and smooth and about there I started twisting not too tight I don't want them 
too tight but hair does drop so if you do like so give that a go if it's too loose you know to do it a bit firmer but of course hair drops once um, you take it out um, so you might want to do it a little bit firmer there you go There you go, I'll show you in the morning what that's like. Um, day two of hairdressing tips. Give me a follow, I'm doing a series on hairdressing tips all of June. Bye bye from Wendy from New Zealand, man, man. Mwah. I'm back again. Because um, they're annoying and it's gonna be annoying when I've slept on it, I've just got another one and put them together and now I'm just gonna whip it over my face. And then it's out of my way for the night. But this is quite good because it'll smooth all that down. Okay, put in the comments if you want to see the end result and more hairdressing tips.